Hey guys, today I have another laptop, it's a Lenovo Legion, uh, the computer is working just fine, all we have to do is to change the thermal paste, clean the fans and the heatsink, you know, the regular basic maintenance that all gaming laptops and not only should have uh, once in a year or two years max as you know the thermal paste is getting dried the cooling system the fans they are getting clogged with with the dust and uh, as the heat is the worst enemy to to a laptop it's better to prevent and keep it clean and maintain the thermal paste uh, soft and not dry and uh, yeah in this way we can uh, take advantage the advantage of the performance of the laptops and uh, you know have them for a longer time period so uh, okay without further ado let's uh, dive in um, first i will see if the laptop is powering on we always do that so yeah, the laptop is powering on. Yeah, I mean, there's like a big screen here. I, I, it's not going to fit for sure. So yeah, as you can see, uh, it's starting right away. Everything is just fine. Uh, let me switch off. All right, let's uh, flip the laptop and uh, Open the back case. Okay. As you can see, there's a lot of dust already. So um, I wonder what we will find inside. Okay. Uh, let me switch the screwdriver tip. A uh, magnet. Hm. Cannot work without magnets. Okay, so the laptop is open. All right, nice. Look how much dust. That's a lot. That's a lot of dust there, as you can see. All right, good. First, let's uh, unplug the battery. Carefully, okay. That's a bit heat sink here, and uh, yeah, let's remove the unplug the fan connectors. This one, this one, too. Okay. I think I just remove and undo all the screws, indeed. And, yeah, we have thermal paste. And let's see how is the thermal paste. I will just grab my spudger. Uh, yeah. Still wet, but for sure, slowly is getting dry. Yeah, here is dry. Okay, good. All right, let's clean the um, the CPU and GPU first. Uh, 
we just cleaned the CPU and the GPU, as you can see. Let's go on the heatsink side. Nice. Shiny. All right. Let's clean the heatsink and then we are going to open the fans and clean the fans inside to see how much that we, we can find there. Okay, uh, yep, let's see, yeah, for sure we need to clean this up. Yeah, as you can see, a lot of dust on the fan itself, but not so much on the fins here, as you can see. Just a little bit of dust. We're going to clean that up. And also the back case. And here, eh, it's almost the same. Okay, just a little bit here in the corner, but for sure the, the laptop was able to breathe here just a little bit on this side and here yeah. as you can see uh, as i told you the client took care of his laptop during the years all right i will do the necessary brush the fans and clean the heatsink and i'll be right back Okay guys, I'm back. As you can see, the fans were cleaned, brushed, just like new. Okay. Up. Hit sink, cleaned. Alright. Let's install the fans back. For some of you guys, uh, this is kind of a boring job. But for other guys, maybe we'll find this video useful. But if this video helps someone, I'm happy. Okay, let's cruise our back. Yeah, I will just uh, wipe a little bit with some IPA. here like this it was a little bit of oof, black okay good now perfectly clean great Next, we should, uh, uh, yeah, uh, yes, of course, I need to wipe a little bit uh, this area too, because I can see a little bit of dust <sighs> right here with a paper towel, a soft paper towel, a little bit of IPA, and that's it. Nothing more. In this way, we trap the dust inside the paper towel with the IPA and we clean very well the area. All right, you see, and we 
we are not spreading into the air the, the dust. Okay. How is it for you guys? It's okay? Nice? Clean? The GPU and the CPU are ready to receive the fresh thermal paste. So for this uh, maintenance I will use uh, Arctic Silver MX6 with high density which will keep this laptop cooler, run smoother and faster for the next year. So to properly apply thermal grease, yeah, you need a little bit of amount, not too much, not too less. So yeah, feel free to, you know, ex uh, experiment while you're applying. So what I will do maybe is like put a dab on it, on the GPU a little bit more. Because anyway, the excess is going to be flushed out when you pressed when you press the heatsink on top. So I think it's more than enough. All right, and now let's uh, place back the heatsink. Let's align everything with the holes. Uh, okay, okay, it's like this. All right, now this should be okay. So the heatsink is back in place. All right, let's screw back everything. Okay, so we are almost there. We just need to connect the battery, and I think uh, our job is done. Nice and clean. So the laptop is ready for one more year of service. Okay, let's connect the battery. Battery is connected. Yeah, I completely forgot. I brush and clean this back cover too. back cover is in place now let's put back the screws and we are done okay Let's try to power on the laptop. Okay, well, it's ginormous. Alrighty then. The laptop is powering on. We have the screen. Windows is loading. Alright. <clears throat> All right, cool stuff. 
Okay, the battery, let's see the Wi-Fi. Available. Yeah, Wi-Fi is working. Let me see. What I will try to do is, um, I have the original charger, of course. Let's see if the battery is charging. So the plug is, uh, nope. Here. Here. Orange light. And the laptop is charging. Good. Okay, guys, I think uh, I will stop here. If you found this uh, video useful, please do like and subscribe for future videos. And uh, yeah, see you on the next one. Bye.